I do I have a video for you guys today. So the last Roblox YouTuber we talked about on this channel was the Roblox who was recently exposed for scamming a 40 year old kid out of 11 million Robux and then he apologized which the apology was just honestly the worst to be honest. Now that we got a scammer out of Roblox, now there was another Roblox YouTuber who can expose also get exposed for scamming. So Jackson video bring you back at again for a brand new video and today we're gonna be talking about one of the worst scammers another yeah you know what I mean so if you haven't even heard of this guy his name is is Jack he's a Roblox youtuber with over 100k subscribers and if you look at his content it's just not great he just makes free Roblox giveaways videos to be honest if you do this kind of content you're, you're just setting yourself up for failure. Like, doing free Roblox giveaways ain't gonna make you grow as a YouTuber. If you think you could be a big YouTuber just by doing free Roblox giveaways, then you're just stupid. Because this that is the worst way to go on YouTube. If you wanna grow on YouTube, just make regular content. That's all you gotta do. Just make regular content. Like, that's all you gotta do. We go with Free Robux giveaways is ain't gonna help you. I know you're gonna be nice and all, but just don't be a free Robux giveaway YouTuber. That's all that's all I'm saying. So yeah. This dude has a Twitter account. His, his Twitter account is the same same thing as his YouTube channel. It's Jack. So so you so you know those tweets so you you know those tweets where people be like, oh, free giveaways, like we tweet, follow, what's your username on it? Yeah. He's he's one of those people. He is one of those people. So so he's getting exposed on Twitter. So the tweets he will make, here what he does. He will tweet some stuff like Roblox Hatless Horseman, get it free. Like we tweet, do all that stuff, blah blah blah. So he would tweet after he finished tweet all that. A few days later, he would just he would just forget about it. And just dip. He would he would not announce anything. He would he would announce the winner at all. So basically, all he's doing, all all he's doing is just scamming kids for followers and, and clout and just likes. That's all he's doing. Just doing that. Now that he's now that everyone noticed that he's a scammer and he just everybody's just exposing him. So basically, he makes this the word of he makes this dumb tweet he says I, I, I just can't I, I, I just can't it's, it's honestly sad to be honest it's honestly sad so here's the here's the tweet he makes alright listen guys this is this is this is Jake's mom as of today Jake has unfortunately decided to end his whole life and no words can describe how sad I am sad face this is sad news for all of us rest in peace Heart emoji. Any support would be appreciated. RT to spread awareness against bullying online. This is not fake. Everyone saying fake and being rude in comments is honestly breaking my heart. Sad face. Just think of how sad your mom would be if your son slash daughter decided to, su to suicide. Some people are dis disgusting, but the nice people will be getting his life over Warbox. There is so much red flags thrown in this tweet like first of all what kind of mom will go on a, on a, on a dead son's twitter account and post them like this and then put the smiley face at the end of it and they put heart emoji like dude come on man Look, luckily no one actually fell for this like no one really fell for this I mean some people actually fell for this because they're actually stupid to be honest so yeah they actually so yeah then, like, here's, here's the thing, like, even though this tweet, if, if, the, if the tweet was real, don't you think it's kind of scummy how a mom is that eager to reclaim the funds of a dead child? Like, dude, that, that's kind of scummy to be honest. Like, that's one, that's one of the worst things you could do on this, dude, like, go on a on son's, on a son's channel and be like, Hey guys, my son died, so he killed his Robux. Yeah, that's game, game of moments. Like, that is... 
Like, how bad do you have to be to, to do stuff, to do something like that? You have to be one of the worst human beings possible. Like, I don't get how bad do you have to be. So, after he first, here's the crazy part. After he tweeted this out, a couple, a, a day later, he deleted a tweet and, po and posted this. Uh, like, I'm like, hold up, are you supposed to be dead? Like, are you supposed to be dead? I thought you were dead. So, yeah. What do you guys think about this? Do you think this guy is a, a, a terrible person or not? Do leave your thoughts in the comments like that. And yeah, that'll be it for this video. Uh, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and until then, peace.